welcome back to the channel. I'm back with a new reaction, and today, guys, it's a special reaction today, guys. Today, I'm going to be checking out a band called Gazatria, their song called Aquarius. I was approached by the vocalist who sent me a nice little message and says, We'd like you to check out our song. I've been good friends with these guys for quite a while now, so without further ado, let's just get straight into this reaction. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to go check this band out. They are absolutely amazing. I'm extremely excited to listen to their new music. This is Gazatria with Aquarius. Hulk smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Ring a ding on bell so miss a video. Let's get into this, guys. This is Gazatria with Aquarius. I'm starting thinking of fairy tale. I wonder if that's where they got it from. We'll see. Ooh. Oh, my style of riffage. That's cool. Woo -hoo! Heavy stuff. Oh, nice. We got some uh, ambience. Whoa, 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 damn. Cow. Oh my. I know he's got an extremely good range of vocals, but man, when he hit that low note, the pitch tone, the tone of his voice then was like pitch perfect. Like, uh, how do I even put it? It just was pitch perfect, man. The levels and the balance of his vocal cords on that part was amazing, man. But I have to say, I am loving the riffage. I'm loving the riffage. I'm not sure which guitarist it was. Maybe was it you, Sai? Was it you, Sai, that did the riffage? Or a joint riffage and all that? And I'm liking the riff riffs on this part as well, which is really, really cool. Because it's shown a lot of experimentation. It's, it's adding some diminished chords in there, which I noticed. I saw like, the diminished like death chords in there. But yeah, let's just continue, guys. <laughs> That was a very interesting part of the song. It almost sounded like he was using some kind of operatic style of vocals. That's how I saw it as, because obviously he's going up and down as the wave pattern of his vocals was going on. But Matt, the riffage underneath it also as well was very well executed. It was almost like a bit similar to the intro riff, but a bit of a change to it, which is what happens in a lot of bands writing, which I think is really, really cool. Okay, I need to shut up. I need to just concentrate on the song. We're halfway through the song already, and I'm loving this. Female vocalist? Okay, okay, right, okay. During Grey Influence? Definitely. Definitely. The highs that Cal just did them were phenomenal. Wow. Okay. <laughs> 
Also, I am digging the look, guys. I, the, the one thing that I find interesting about Gazatria is that I find them very influenced by Lynch. And they are awesome band you guys definitely should check out as well because they're, they're awesome. But I, I'm loving the look as well. It's, it's almost like a kind of like kind of like Joker look. But obviously, it's got like balls instead of being like a scar face. But yeah, man. There is a female vocalist in the song. I love the ambience in the in the chorus. It's so good. Are oh, we gonna end it with a break? Okay, I'm not exaggerating. That was an absolutely superb song by Gazatria. Aquarius, man. Oh my god. I mean, I've pretty much said about what I feel about as the song went on as I paused it. But I love the ambience in the chorus. And also, how come... I don't know. I know there was a female vocal... I'm pretty sure there was a female vocalist in there as well. So I don't know whether that was just like background for the song itself but it would have been nice if maybe the female vocalist was introduced in the music video maybe uh, or I, I don't, that's just my thoughts that it might have been cool now i mean i mean obviously maybe not part of the band like it's because uh, i know there's a lot of bands out there that use a female vocalist in some parts randomly it's like caliban did it once on one of their really really old songs they had a singer in one of their bridge parts and that was really cool but man, the riffage straight up metalcore with a bit of like groove to it, which is really cool. I loved all the guitar breaks. All the guitar breaks, absolutely amazing, man. And all again, I'm gonna say it again. I love the ambience of this, the, the, of the chorus, the ambience of how uh, it's just unbelievable. And some of Cal's vocals in this one, he showcased so much different distinctions it was unreal because literally like he's he, he does his mids well he does his highs well and he does his, his low this time I, i've never seen him like do his lows that so prominent so prominent and like tone pitched perfect that was absolutely insane and the, the part where it sounded like during greg now that that i gotta give props for that 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 was just fucking amazing I am though, I am though wondering like how many, because um, when you do your recordings, you were uh, basically do, uh, I'm trying to think what the word is now. Yeah, double the tracks up or something like that to make it sound like that. Or basically it did three different tracks, one like in the mid range, then a high range and then a higher, higher range or some. So I'm not too sure because I'm not, I, I, I'm not into like vocal recordings because I'm a guitarist myself. So I don't know about that. But overall, Gazetri Aquarius song. I mean, I'm not sure whether it's influenced by Fairy Tale Aquarius. <laughs> I know I'm probably just putting that in there just for the pun for the sake of it. But man, guys, absolutely banging tune, man. Absolutely loved it. I also thank you for letting me to be able to react to it. I also place links in the bottom in the bottom that will people will be able to check out the uh, links to your current album coming out, Celeste and all that stuff and they can check out your facebook your instagram and i think your twitters and all that stuff i'll make sure all that's in the box below so everyone can see that but guys man absolute amazing song guys just keep it up um absolutely amazing so yeah guys if you guys enjoyed the reaction 
Hulk smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Ring a ding that bell so you don't miss a video. And don't forget, there's a link in the description to the original video without my loud ass voice. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.